Hey guys, so a lot of people are always asking me um, how I do swirly writing, like this. And I thought I would give you a very quick lesson on how I do it so that if you want to start practicing, you can get good. The only really, the only way you can really get good at this is to practice and practice and practice. Um, I have spent a lot of time <laughs> diddling and practicing doing swirly writing but there is a really simple way to make swirly writing look a little bit better which i'm going to show you right now so if we take a pen and we write hello now i add loops where i can again the more you practice this the more you'll be able to do the loops neatly what i did is i went online and found pictures of people who'd written things in swirly writing and just tried to copy them until you learn the way that you do it. Now, the way to make this look better is every time your pen's going down, so here I'm going up, here I'm going down, you're going to double up this line. You're going to do that the whole way along. So this is an up line, this is a down line, up line, down line, up line, down line, up down, up, but then also down, up, down, and then just colour in those down lines. Or leave them blank if you think that looks cool. Sometimes I do. And that is a super simple way to make it look ten times better with very little effort. And then what you can do is you can play around with colours. So uh, on this sheet here, you can see I then outlined it in orange and then outlined that in yellow. And that looks really cool. Um, but like, it's all about practice. So here's me practicing on other days. And sometimes it goes well, and sometimes alphabets turn out really horrible, but this is just me trying out different people's ways of writing and finding ones that look for me look that work for me. Um, these are ones without them being filled in and they just don't look as good. You can see R's. Don't know how to do R's. Hey there sunshine. Quite like that one. Could be neater. But I just copied someone else's way of looping the S's which I've always really struggled with. All the practice. You're not gonna be an incredible um, swirly writer <laughs> without practice. But give it a go, It's I really enjoy it, I find it really calming for me. Um, some of you might, some of you will not want to do this, and that is okay too. But if you want to give it a go, give it a go, and let me know how you get on, show me pictures, I'd love to see your attempts. 